The most basic description of empathy is feeling with people without judging them. As a skill, empathy allows us to weave events from the point of view of others, better understand and control our own emotions, and anticipate how others will react to our actions and attitudes. These abilities allow us to better function in a workplace and are desirable attributes for anyone starting their professional lives. Empathy in gaming and esports is not very different from empathy in other aspects of life. Amongst all the high-paced activity and split-second decision-making, esports requires us to use our empathy skills to show acceptance towards how our teammates and opponents feel about the game. By accepting their feelings, we can provide an enjoyable gaming experience for everyone involved, including ourselves. Empathy also helps us self-regulate our own emotions when we're gaming and competing. This self-regulation enables us to keep a cool head even when we're losing. Without empathy, any gamer is much more likely to experience tilting, feelings of unsatisfaction, or judging and flaming others in the game. We can exercise our own empathy skills in gaming by giving space to our teammates and opponents to experience their feelings and share them. By using positive language and understanding the sensitive spots of others, we can help our team better perform in competitive matches. Patience, a virtue born from empathy, also helps a gamer increase both their personal and team game performance. This chart can serve as a guide to show how during gaming and competing you can practice vital empathy components like understanding and supporting others as well as yourselves. I give others space to be in their feelings. I use positive coach talk to help others and myself feel connected or heard. I reflect on what I can control through my actions. I do not judge, blame or flame others. I show patience to others. You can use this chart to set goals for how you will treat others and yourself in and out of the game. Refer to the chart to coach others on improving self-regulation of their emotions.